Ah, oh, it's been a long day. Time to sit back and play some PUBG. Um, hello? What? Another update? Are you serious? I will not update this game again three days in a row. Okay, so I didn't actually smash my Xbox, uh, but I did uninstall PUBG just for the video. Obviously, I'm reinstalling it right now. So another 19 gigabyte update for us to download, even though just two days ago we had an update for six gigabytes on Xbox for the latest patch, a hotfix which fixed the issue with the parachutes disappearing. I even heard some people saying that that wasn't even fixed, but this one, this hotfix, would require us to download the entire game again, and it's being applied to revert the new blood effects that were implemented with update 5.3 and alleviate instances of game crashing. So I guess in order to do this, they had to make us download the entire game again, basically. Now for me, that's not too big of a deal because I have pretty good internet and I can download these patches within 10 minutes or so, even if they're around 20 gigabytes. But for people with really slow internet, it can be a major problem. While it's nice to see them fixing these issues so fast and getting on them really quickly, it really, really stinks for people that have slow internet to update the game over and over. And say you're a player that only plays the game every once in a while, say you play it once a week, a couple times a month, you just jump on with your friends, if the game requires constant updating, it's gonna make you want to uninstall the game just so it doesn't waste bandwidth for yourself. If I only played PUBG once a month or twice a month or whatever, just every so often, I probably wouldn't have it installed and then I'd just install it whenever I wanted to play it because basically that's what I'd have to do with some of these updates. So yes, while I do appreciate and like the fact that they're fixing the game as fast as possible, man, these update sizes really suck and they can really be frustrating. But yeah, in case you guys didn't know what this update was for, why you had to re-download the game once again, it's because they had to take away some of the blood effects. I wish they would have just left it, but apparently they fixed some crashing instances as well, so hopefully that actually does fix it and it doesn't make all this time downloading the game for nothing. But with that said, that's probably going to be my last video until after the Christmas break. So I wanted to wish you guys a Merry Christmas if you do celebrate. If not, Happy Holidays at the very least. And if you don't celebrate the holidays at all, just have a good rest of your week. Make sure to like the video if you found it useful and subscribe to stay up to date on everything that I publish. You can follow me on Twitter at YTBoris15. But with all that being said, hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Have a fun and safe holiday, and I'll talk to you later.